My name is Eddie Charlie. My Indian name is Sinemtin. I'm from the Cochin Nation, and I'm a survivor of the Cooper Island Residential School. As a survivor of residential school myself, I find that Orange Heart Day is really important because a lot of children uh, were taken away from their homes forcibly when they were very young. So Orange Heart Day is this one opportunity when everybody can come together to reclaim their identity and their lost traditions. Now, I think you have to look at our spirits in much the same way as a river. If you throw something that's no good into the river, it touches everything down along the way. And we've been contaminated by hate, pain, and aggression. And until we clean up that river, we'll always be stuck in that real bad place. If you want to participate in Orange Heart Day, you need to listen to the stories of the survivors. I experienced enough pain to last me three lifetimes, and it's time for me to to release some of that anger, some of that pain, by allowing people to see what's inside here, so that they can understand what happened to 150,000 other children. This is why I think Orange Heart Day is really important, because it gives us an opportunity to talk to people and show them that healing can happen. We're inspiring people to want to be a part of this movement. And not just Indigenous people, but the non-Indigenous community is starting to become aware of what happened to these 150,000 children. And healing will start real slow, but gradually when we start to learn to trust each other again, I think Orange Heart Day will give us that opportunity to use our voices in an equal way again.